Hello everybody, welcome back to Digital Devil Saga. Last time we started making our way out of the trap we fell into, and today, hopefully, we can actually get out of it. Though so it should just be over this way, to start. So that's where we fought those guys at the end of last episode. Hey, level up for Agilla there. Anyway, we do need to go this way. I feel like there's a gate we opened or something. Or a gate we need, we need to open, apparently. Let's pop open gate number five here. Gate number five unlocked. Yeah, and that should just take, our, take us right to the exit, it looks like. Sweet. Probably gonna be like one more horde of like 15 guys though. Yep, there's the exit right there. Oh, and the vendor. Oh, there's a guy in front of the door. But no one's holding this one shut anymore. Oh, okay. I guess I no one's holding this one shut anymore. So that's handy. I'm gonna go to the vendor real quick. I have stuff to sell. Got a few, yeah, lots of cash. And the quantum, there we go. Very nice. Is there any more ammo we want to get? I mean, probably. Attack power 40. Or 32 in a freeze. Let's get like one of these. Just to have it. Because why not? Gail can have it. There we go. And I guess I'll just pop in here and heal and save before I fight that guy. Alright, let's go mess him up. I said, wait, damn it! Oh. That's unexpected. An Atavaka. Hopefully it's not, like, a bunch of them. Uh... I just throw things at him, see what sticks, as usual. That wasn't bad. I guess it makes sense for the last one to be a bit more threatening. I should have Tarooned it. Oh, he's weak to Earth. Good. Okay. Yeah, even though he's weak to Earth, I think I will uh, Tarooned this turn. Even though he probably has Dekunda. Like everything. But if it wastes one of his turns, I'll take it. Ow, that did a lot. Don't like that. What does stun do? I feel like it lowers accuracy or something. Something weird like that. I'm gonna Tarunda one more time here. I should probably heal whatever that is on Gale, his stun. I still have Mahama. I don't know how much that's going to come in handy. In this fight, anyway. Uh, just stun. Just to be safe. Wait, it doesn't seem like too much of a threat at the moment. Oh, oh he can just stun my entire party. That's cool. Thank you. Uh... Dude. I don't know if it's just, like, physical attacks that get lowered. I guess we'll find out. 
Probably everything. All right. I slowly just steal that off everybody. Can't get stunned again if I already am though. Big brain. No, it's stupid. You know, at least, um, Surf and Gale, I think. Because in our Jill, I can just heal Surf. I need to stay on healing duty for a little bit. Even though she does have the thing he's weak to. Yeah, we'll heal her up again. Maybe another- oh, Mind's Charge. Ma powerful magic attack. What magic does he use? Um... I don't know. He's in the red, though. Maybe we can take him down before he, he gets to pop it off. Do we risk a Terra here? Or do we heal Gale? Let's heal Gale. Moragian. Okay, that's bad for Sir. He's gonna do it again, isn't he? Oh, nope. Okay. We might be able to take him down, though. If we get lucky. Which doesn't look like we're going to be. I'll try Terra. Missed. Why did he mind charge twice? Doesn't matter, I guess we took him down. Yeah, not too bad. Level up for Gale. And we're free! Should I heal first? Yeah, I'll go heal. Okay, let's get out of here. Run away! Oh, we're just chilling? Okay. They are one step ahead of us. Bat and Mick are more intelligent than they seem. What should I do? It's all my fault. Who are you? Tell me things. Janana's dead. We lost our territory. And everyone's acting weird. Yeah? Sorry about that. But you're on our side now, that counts for something, yeah? I hope. Anyway, we should get back to, uh, Muladara. Oh, our people are gone. Oh no. Oh, you're still here. What's up? I- I didn't run away. That was part of my strategy. If you know you're outclassed in battle, escape and rearrange your forces. That's a basic tenet of warfare. Don't blame me. Oh, you're fine. Oh no! Am I going to die? Again? I'm tired of dying. Mother. Oh no. Guess Mick's been here. Is it just Mick, or did he bring people with him? Oh no. Sir, I think this girl will make it. I'm sorry. Mick took the girl. Oh no. The solids. They attacked us. I guess we should check on Cielo. See if he knows where Sarah went. Oh. There's a lot of blood here now. Cielo still chilling in here? No. Where is he? Uh-oh. Council room? Whatever it's called. Strategy room?
Why the hell couldn't you protect one girl? Huh? I'm sorry. I... <clears throat> Why are you so concerned with Sarah? You do not know, do you? I'll kill you! That's enough! It is not just heat. You have all changed since Sarah arrived. You may be confused, but do not blame Cielo. Cute little speech. But what about you, huh? I have not changed. I am myself. The solution lies in Sarah's lost memories. Instead of simply lashing out, let us think. Where is Sarah? They allowed you to live in order to give us that information. Where is she? The Northern Ruins at coordinate 136. Heat! He cannot succeed alone. We should follow. I... I want to come along too! I gotta redeem myself for all this! You should rest here. You won't be much help if you're hurt. Hey, Heat's back in the party. I'm gonna talk to Cielo again. And everybody else. Cielo also shows signs of emotional instability. I wonder if this power is causing the change. Everything is going to change. Sarah will guide us, whether she knows it or not. I don't just want to get even. I owe her now. Damn it. Yeah, just rest up here, Cielo. You'll be okay. Heat's not here. It's kind of a nice touch. She just kind of ran ahead. But yeah, I guess we need to go to coordinate 136 now. Try to track down Mick again. I really thought we would have had him by now. I keep saying like, oh, let's go fight Mick. Oh, let's go fight Mick. No. Like the fourth or fifth time now. I ordered a watch on Cielo. He may try to leave on his own. It is becoming difficult to keep the tribe members under control, especially Heat. Have you noticed? Yeah, a little bit. Coordinate 136. That's where the ruins are. They're using Sarah as bait to lure us into their trap. Stop screwing around. We need to get Sarah back. Ruins of what, though? We will keep watching Cielo. Surf, you be careful as well. I'm tired of seeing people die. It hurts, but I can fight. Please, sir. I want to be useful. All the, all the little guys came through, that's really nice. I'm kind of going to chat to them, talking to them every time I come through here. Oh good, he's back up. I wonder what Nirvana's like. Is it really worth all this trouble? With my Atma powers, and my gunfire, we're the perfect couple. No rival tribe can withstand the might of our combined powers. Oh, I think that was the other lady. Whatever. <laughs> Next time, they won't stand a chance. Hint, hint, I guess, to uh, combine uh, magic with guns sometimes. If you hadn't caught on to that yet. Long Forgotten Ruins at coordinate 136. Let's go. Castle. Looks to be in good good shape, despite being called ruins. What the hell? I've never seen a building like that. 
then why do I feel like I know it? Nobody's ever been here. We, have, we haven't been here before? You think we would know where we live? A little bit. What's this building? I've seen it somewhere before. These must be the ruins. I assume they want us to proceed inside. The ruins of what? Many old cities are buried underneath the junkyard. This appears to be one such city, though the style of architecture is unlike others I have seen. There are no apparent uses for such, such an odd style. I do not comprehend. Is this an amusement park? What is an amusement park? I'm not exactly sure. Lately, I have trouble understanding you. The world seems to ignore logic, and people are acting irrationally. Okay, amusement park. It's a place to have fun. Fun? I do not comprehend. We should proceed with caution. That was kind of funny. <laughs> and interesting at the same time. Yeah, I guess we just waltz right in. Ticket barriers down. Sorry, my little friend. The guard not one let us outside this room. Hey, little help, please. If I open this door, Gale will eat me alive. It isn't me. It's, uh, the cat. The cat's doing it. I think he wants to go outside. The cat? You mean a cat cat? Yeah, that cat. Oh, he's so cute. Come on, let him out. <coughs> nice work, little bro. Hey, where are you going? Static broadcast can be heard from somewhere. Welcome to Destiny Land's beautiful mystery castle. The story to be told now is that of a beautiful princess and two princes. What dramatic conclusion awaits you along this path? Now, open the door and watch the tale unfold. Let us depart on a journey of mystery and adventure. The transmission faded away. I like mystery and adventure. Oh, I was gonna say something actually. I guess we're gonna fight this thing first. Ah, oh, more. As he goes by here. Hey, that worked. Try a Zanma, why not? Not bad. And goodbye, probably. Yeah, there he goes. Oh yeah, he's back. And he leveled up along with us, that's nice. He needs a new uh, mantra, though. Good thing there's a terminal right here. Anyway, I was going to point out that, that that longer scene with Cielo just now, really fun, really cute. <laughs> but um, his uh, new voice is a bit more apparent, which is uh, it's nice to hear him talk like that again. He's so monotone to begin with. Anyway. Uh, get Mantra first. E1 for Heat. It's not quite there yet. Can get Poison Dart, Raving Slash. You probably want something more physical than the fire magic. Like, he prefer physical, I think. Counter. That could be good. 
Let's go for a uh, demon lord, I think. Why not? Okay, where do we need to go? That big door. I want to check over here. That's not a door. That's a wall pretending to be a door. So I guess we just head on in. Static broadcasting we heard from somewhere. This story took place not long ago. In a certain kingdom, there lived a beautiful princess with mysterious powers. Her powers were very special, for they protected the country and drove away hardship. However, one day an evil being captured the princess and planned to use her powers for evil. She was imprisoned high up in a tall tower. In a neighboring kingdom, there lived two princes who happened to be close friends of the princess. Their personalities were exact opposites of one another. One prince was always kind. The other was brash and took a liking to violence. Thus, behind their backs, people began calling them the good prince and the evil prince. In fact, the princess was secretly in love with the good prince. She looks familiar. I guess I'm not going that way. Iron bars prevent further advancement. Do they though? We couldn't slip through those. Break them. I mean, we are demons. Oh, come on. Easily go through there. I guess all of them have bars. Let's uh, check out this thing though. There is no response. You're talking to a statue, what do you expect? I can't go that way. Do I have to check all these or something? That's a pillar. Wait, that's that's a table. Hey, something new. With Maka Jam. Please stop. How dare you. Apstaris. They're probably weak to fire. So maybe we can get heat in here. Oh hey. I'm trying to devour Fall more. Get him out of the way. There we go. Well, they also probably use ice though, so. Oh, they block electric. Never mind. This is a problem. Let's uh, try and get what's his face in here. Heat. Swip him, swap, swip him. Switch, swap. With our Jilla. See what uh, fire does to these guys. Okay, cool. Surf's still asleep though. Smack him around a bit here. And a Miragi. Oh cool, I spooked it. Eat her up. And Jilla mastered uh, Earth Temple. Or Tarazi, Avalanche, and Earth Repel. That'll be nice. So swap, swap, I cannot talk today. Slap some of those on her. Definitely Tarazi. Might pass an Avalanche for now. Uh, I guess we'll get her a new mantra and heal up. And Surf mastered his on the way. Hermazio, finally, an Alec boost. Okay, what's Surf looking for now? I don't have a ton of money. He could probably do with some more uh, physical moves, though, couldn't he? How much is 4,000? Let's see what our Jilla wants first. Oh, she can get Hades. I mean, Tama. I mean, Tama's 15. Oh, it's not me, Tama. Tama's 20. Ancient God is 15. Ah, uh, Mahama and Secunda. Secunda could be nice. Or 
box. Those could be really good too. I might give her Fallen Hero and give Surf uh, whatever's on top there, honestly. Let's do that. And Surf can get... Demon Beast, yeah. Still don't know where to go. Surf leveled up. Let's see. Agility, luck. Or luck and agility, whichever one I pick first, I guess. And magic, why not? Hey, free agility too. Sweet. There's gotta be something I'm missing in this big room here. No response. Okay. Oh, a voice emanates. Oh, my good prince, I wish I could convey how my heart truly feels. Dearest traveler, might you carry these tidings to my beloved? As for his whereabouts, a fairy named Twinkle Bell may be able to guide you. Otherwise, ask the people. The people behind those doors. No, forget what I just asked of you. I am a captive. Dreaming otherwise will only cause pain and sorrow. Alright, well, that opened the way. Let's ask Twinkle Bell here. Hi there, how are you? Are you enjoying Mystery Castle? My name's Twinkle Bell, and I'll be your navigator today. Nice to meet you. The first attraction is... Show the prince how much the princess loves him. There are a lot of portraits on this floor, all of the prince. Unfortunately, there's only one portrait of the good prince whom she loves. Please convey her love to the right person. If you listen carefully to what everyone says, you should be able to find him. The good prince is dressed in blue. Don't forget that. If you talk to the evil prince, prince, if you talk to the evil prince, you'll be in big trouble. Well then, happy searching. Thanks, Twinkle Bell. I guess we'll start here. After this, went to poke around to my skills after that last fight and realized uh, Heat needs to get a couple more on him. Let's get him a uh, definitely Void Ice. We give him Void Fire too. I think that'd be good actually. Give him a couple voids. All right, now let's go through this door. Oh, these people we can talk to? Some people fell victim. Some people, I, this, I, words don't even exist and I can read them. Some fell victim to the evil prince's traps. Please return safely. I don't want to fall for traps. The good prince was always calm. I've heard that he lived by the credo, slowly make haste. Okay. Nobles look identical when seen from a distance. The only way to distinguish good from evil is to examine them up close. Alright. Like this guy? How close do we have to get? They're not wearing blue. I think this is like those, uh, yeah, that's the dead end. I think this is like those, uh, statues from the, uh, Solid's base. Pretty sure that's where they were. Like, if I step there, it's gonna drop me down to a basement or something. Oh. There are one way doors here. That's good to be aware of. Oh, no. Look, the one way door got me. That guy's wearing red. Uh oh. Here we go. What is it with this game and falling into dungeons? Voice is heard from- oh, yep, there he is, skeleton on the wall. Hello. I'm sure you've already figured out that you're boned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is that funny? <laughs> I love skeleton jokes. That's a fancy door. For being a- it's a one, another one wing door. Technology is incredible. Is this a door I can go through? It is. And it's not one way. 
That's probably a good sign. It's probably the corridor I'm gonna have to walk up every time I fall down, isn't it? Hey, level up for Gale. I'm gonna have to switch our Jilla back in at some point to get her some levels. Oh, yep, stairs up. Dead end. So where does this take me? Oh. Okay, cool, I'm right back here. There's three of them, what the heck? I don't want your treasure, my guy. I can get triple debilitated now? Yes. I have no interest in your treasure. Leave me alone. Missed. And goodbye. Oh no, they're just gonna continue to go. Well, I used it four times, so I guess four is the um, limit. It's good to establish. Because I would have said, like, can't go lower or something. I was gonna go to the terminal, actually. I didn't want to fight this unicorn. Anyway. I think since we're back at the terminal, it's a good place to stop for today. So I guess next time we try to make our way through this maze of portraits. And see how many times we fall into the dungeon and have to work our way back up. I'm sure it will be many. But yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you then.